Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to connect your Xbox One controller to your Windows computer through a Bluetooth. This means that your controller will be completely wireless, you won't have to use any cables or anything like that. To start off with, if you're using a laptop you should already have Bluetooth built in. Or if you're using a computer without Bluetooth, you're going to need a Bluetooth adapter. The Bluetooth adapter I will be using in this video, there will be a link in the description below if you want to purchase this one. Now go ahead and plug in your Bluetooth adapter and in the bottom right hand corner now, you should have a Bluetooth symbol. You need to right click on that and go add a Bluetooth device or if you don't have that you can go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and you can search Bluetooth and you can select Bluetooth and other devices. Once you're on this screen, you need to make sure your Bluetooth is turned on. And once you're happy with that, we now need to go on to add Bluetooth or other device. You now need to select Bluetooth. And you now need to turn on your Xbox One controller and press the top button of your controller. And as you can see straight away, it's come up with Xbox Wireless Controller. You now need to select that and it will start to connect. And once it's connected, you can now press done. And now in this list, you should see your Xbox One wireless controller. I'm now going to go ahead and boot up a game just to show you that it works and I'm not actually plugged in. And straight away, as you can see, I am using my Xbox One wireless controller on seven days to die. And it's as easy as that. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.